Rag and fine tuning are very different concepts, and this simple workflow shows them both in action. With Rag, we can make vast amounts of data available to our AI systems. This often uses a vector database where we embed and chunk all of our data into these systems. And then we can query and retrieve that data as we need. So we could ask this AI agent a question, it will go and fetch the up to date information from the vector store. On the other hand, fine tuning is generally not about giving the model new information, it's about taking a base model such as GPT 4.1 one and then running a smaller additional round of training data over that model. The data can be as simple as this, where we have some example prompts and the example responses that we expect the AI to give. The end result of this is a fine-tuned model that will then mimic the style, format, and type of output based on your training examples. You can create a fine-tuned model directly from the OpenAI Playground, or you can use a more scalable system like the one we built using Airtable and N8N. To use a fine-tuned model within N8N, just simply go into the model name, so we have this output model name, and then within an an OpenAI model node like here, instead of selecting the model from the list, then go to expression and make sure ID is selected and then paste in your model name. And now this node will use this fine-tuned model. There are a lot of benefits to using fine-tuned models. They're really specialized. They can really learn your style of response, but they do have some limitations. And that is that they can mess with the output of an AI agent, may not call the right tools, for example, unless you've been very careful about your training data. Separating out your call to the fine-tuned model away from your main AI agent logic makes this act as a nice presentation layer without you having to mess with the original logic of your agent. If you want to watch my full video on this, then click the play button and link at the bottom of this video.